Okay, we're back at the at this house where we did the backyard cleanup yesterday. So if you haven't seen that video, I'll link to that up here. Uh, so it's Sunday, but this video is not going to go up until the next weekend when I have my boys. Uh, so I'll edit this during the week, but it's Sunday, and we're going to make some side hustle money. Um, so uh, weird. So uh, we got to continue with mowing this yard because we got rained out yesterday and it just got a little bit late in the day, uh, Saturday. And so I didn't want to be mowing after five o'clock on a Saturday. So we're back now today. So we're going to go ahead and do the uh, cut edge trim, weed eat front and back, and we're going to shape up that bush. And that's one of the uh, four yards that I still got to do. I did a video a little bit while back where we trimmed up these trees and trimmed up that big old bush. I did it with my boys on a weekend. Uh, so this is the first time that I'm actually doing that, that shrub again since that video. I'll try to find it in my library and I'll link to it, but I'll probably, uh, I probably forget. <laughs> I'm not that much of a poindexter. The reason why my shirt's tucked in is because the belt clip from my phone, which is my MP3 player as well, um, I don't. if my shirt's untucked and my phone touches my skin and when I'm hot and sweaty, that irritates the piss out of me. So that's why I usually like to tuck in a t-shirt and then wear a shirt or something. But uh, And the second thing is, you know, I don't like my bushes to be like a museum. I like to round them and, you know, just make things soft and natural looking.
right, today we're going to break out the FS100RX um, instead of the Combi 90 that you've been seeing me use, the KM90R. Uh, this is the FS100RX. It's got a longer uh, shaft. Uh, I'm just more comfortable with this, but whatever. I'm going to weed eat first because I'm going to pull the clippings out of that flower bed where I just trimmed the bush. And in the backyard, we did all that cleanup in yesterday's video. I'm going to pull some stuff out with the weed eater, and then when I mow, I'm going to you know, mulch it all up. saying Dan why did you just go around all the edges with the weed eater when you just did it with the edger because you saw that was real time you saw it took me 20 seconds 15 seconds to do this whole area here and that strip there it take what 45 seconds to do the whole yard to put eyes on the edge to ensure the edger blade missed nothing and that there's no weeds growing in the cracks of the sidewalks so it just takes a second to do and I highly recommend you do it, it makes a difference
our root knuckles. So what you got over there now is we chopped up a lot of the, the clippings and now we just pass through with the blower real quick just before we mow. There's not much left up there. We grinded weeds, we chopped up the clippings, there's nothing to rake and the mower will finish it. No power, no no rocks to a window. for weed spray. the idiots that asked me if I'm gonna buy a new hose now that the weed eater beat it up. Come on, man.
my goal right now is to get all the mulch blown in and blown through so we don't lose it and kind of clean the bed out a little bit, get some of this cleaned up so then we could just mow.
tell you're driving this car? Mm -hmm. You're gonna kick your ass now if you put a scratch on it. <laughs> All right, man. All right. So we're done. That's a nice clean job. Looks good. Bush is trimmed. So I'm gonna go do the backyard and then I'm gonna, just gonna show you guys the finished product of the backyard. A few weeks ago I did a video and I talked about the different ways that, that people will mow or bag or mulch and then double mow depending on the condition of the lawn and you know if it if it's cleaning up the clippings in one pass or if you have to do it twice, do you rake, what do you do? And I had said some people will leave the clippings on the grass and then just go with their blower. That's not my preferred method, but on my channel, I like to show you guys everything. So this is, this is what I mean. There's clippings on the lawn. There's clippings on the lawn. And so I just take the blower and I'm just gonna blow it off. My preferred method would be to double cut or bag it at this point. So I, I wanna show you. Again, that's not my preferred method, but it's a method, and people will do it, so I wanted to show it. I don't really like it. Um, anyways, there's the back. There's the backyard now, mowed and all cleaned up. So I'll put a video thumbnail up to yesterday's video at the end of this video um, that shows you start to finish cleaning up this whole back area. What a mess. But came out good I mean as you can see now it looks really nice this was a thick backyard which it shows it in that video it shows how tall and thick this grass was so not bad man looks really nice cut down two and a half inches set of pea grass right where it needs to be looking good all right guys we uh, finished another one here so it's a funny story with this lady that's her mom and um, two weeks ago when I did the yard the mom came out, chewed me out because I went through with my weed eater and whipped down all the weeds in the flower beds up there. Come to turn out, they, they weren't really weeds. They were mint and different herbs and stuff she planted. So we have this ongoing joke now that I'll be really careful so she don't come out and kick my ass. She came out today wagging her finger at me and we got a good laugh over it. But So I didn't do up in the beds or anything. But uh, So but this one's done, so that's the second one. So, I mean, we're, we're done for the weekend for our side hustle business. I got my yard and my neighbor's yard to do, and I'll just squeeze them out in the next couple of days after work. Um, it's Sunday night, almost 5 o'clock. We got a really late start today. Um, so, I'll go ahead and get these videos edited, or this video edited. And really, it's just, you know, 80 bucks uh, side hustle today, cutting some yards with a 21-inch mower. And then yesterday, we did um, a big clean-out job. And uh, I'm going to link to that at the end of this video. And um, we did the acre mowing. So we did a pretty good job of side hustle income this weekend. You know, with just a mower. Um, it could have all been done in one day if I didn't stop to do videos. And the cleaners coming to my house today. And, you know, different things. Um, but it was a successful side hustle weekend. So why don't you guys leave a comment below. And let me know about your side hustle weekend. And uh, just tell me what you guys are up to. Tell me about your equipment. You know, tell me how many yards you're doing. And, uh, you know, everybody needs an attaboy, so let me give you an attaboy or an girl for that matter. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Tell me about the whistle. The whistle.